Dominic DeGrazia on behalf of the people. And Brian Brown on behalf of Mr. Jackson Bolanos. Brenda Christian Murphy on behalf of Mr. Jackson Bolanos, who's present to my right. And I'd also recommend Mr. Jackson Bolanos is present, as are all counsel, and our 12 jurors have returned to the courtroom uh, again this morning. Um, we took yesterday off because there were some conflicts. You came back this morning and been diligently uh, working. We produced yet another transcript for you uh, and uh, just after lunch, and we received a note a little while ago indicating that um, you are still deadlocked as to two of the counts. You've reached a verdict as to two of the counts, and you are not making any more progress. Is that correct? Yes, sir. Who is your foreperson? You are actually juror number 15. 15? Okay. Uh, juror number 15, um, we will take a partial verdict as to the two counts that you have reached a verdict on, and if you haven't reached a verdict, just say deadlocked, okay? And if you have reached a verdict, uh, read what's next to the box you checkmarked under that count. Okay, so the clerk is going to take the verdict from you. Please stand. And uh, after she reads the count and the charge, you read what's next to it or deadlock if you're deadlocked. Thank you. In the case of the people of the state of Michigan versus Michael Manuel Jackson Bolanos, Mr. Fourperson, will you please read the verdict form as marked as to count one first degree felony murder? Deadlock. As to count two first degree premeditated murder? Not guilty. As to count three, home invasion first degree? Deadlock. And as to count four, concealing facts or misleading the police? Guilty. All jurors, please stand and raise your right hands. Members of the jury, listen to your verdict as recorded by the court. You do say upon your oath that you find Michael Manuel Jackson Bolanos. <clears throat> hung as to count one first degree felony murder not guilty as to count two first degree premeditated murder hung as to count three home invasion first degree and guilty of count four concealing facts or misleading the police so say you Mr. Fourperson so say you members of the jury thank you, thank you. Thank you. Can you would you like the members of the jury poll no no, you're... no? no. okay um Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. I know this went much longer than we ever thought it would, and you you did uh, yeoman's work in this case, and we appreciate your attempts to come back day after day and try to reach a verdict, because after such a long trial, we wanted to give every opportunity to try to reach a full verdict as to all counts, and, and I understand it's just not possible. So um, I am gonna come back and speak with you personally uh, and uh, give you some certificates uh, from the court, uh, and then, um, I believe the attorneys are going to want a chance to talk to you as well, and you'll be able to talk to them. Uh, the, the restriction of not talking to attorneys is now lifted for you uh, in this case. Um, I guess I'd prefer you not give interviews to the press because we're going to have to possibly retry the case as to counts one and three. And so, um, it, you know. so anyway, but uh, you are free to do uh, what you want. And uh, so at this time, uh, you are dismissed from your duties as jurors in this case. And we appreciate your time, attention, and efforts in this case. Uh, so the deputies are going to lead you back over to Judge Nash Court, and I'll be over there momentarily uh, to come address you, and then the attorneys will come after I have a chance to talk to you in private. Okay? Uh, all rise for the jury. Sooner the better. Next week. Yeah. Um, my calendar for next week. Uh, 
And Judge, I'd ask for at least a week because so 25th. The Thursday the 25th at uh, noon? Yeah. Does that work? That's fine, Judge. Okay. So Thursday the 25th at noon, we'll have a pretrial. If there are any motions you plan to make, please um, file that as soon as possible. Uh, the written motions. Uh, and uh, we will uh, address everything then and set a new trial date if it's going to be retried. And Judge, I may have missed this, but is the court going to formally enter an order declaring a mistrial on those? Uh, yes, on those I am declaring a okay. mistrial as to counts uh, one and three, and I, I have the order in front of you. Thank you, Judge. Thank you. 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 Thank Hold off on referring to PSI until I get her counsel. We'll figure that out next week. Okay? That concludes this hearing.